Good morning and welcome to It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta. We are joined this morning by Mr. Louis Agudo. Welcome to the show this morning, Louis. Hey, thank you for having me here. <laughs> How, uh, uh oh, how are you feeling this morning, Louis? Uh, dare I'm, I ask? I'm feeling no. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good. You know, every day above ground is a great day. Well, that's uh, that's thing. Louis, thank you for joining us yet again. Um, nice tie, uh, groomed hair. What are you running for something? <laughs> 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 It's that time of the year. Uh, so we're here ready to promote you. I know you're from New York. You spent some time up in, uh, what's the island down there? Long Island? It's uh, a long island. Hampton. Yes. Yeah, the yes. Hamptons, all yes. that stuff. So good stuff. Um, tell us uh, your business. We want to promote you. You've got about 29.5 seconds. All right. Well, you know, we, we know I'm... <laughs> Peter, I'm glad you asked that question. I'm CEO of It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta. <laughs> Thank you. And also of the Open Door Insurance Group. And my focus actually for the next few months is Medicare. I'm a Medicare senior specialist. And I have 38 um, activities coming up, meetings all over the metro Atlanta area. Um, hopefully I'll be getting in front of over a thousand people to speak about what Medicare is, how it works, because no one understands it. And it really doesn't matter if you're under 65 or you have on a group plan or employee plan or you're over 65 on Medicare, nobody understands health insurance. You're right, Lewis, and I know you're very sought after as a speaker. I'm excited to, to uh, very knowledgeable in what you do. And what I'd like to, you to do now is just share with the listening audience how people can best reach you. You know, I'd like you to go to, it, to the website. Um, it's a great day for business, Atlanta and look me up there. Or you can call me at 404-375-7461. Outstanding. Lewis. Yes. Books. I mean, speakers are readers, right? Right. In order to be a great speaker, you better be a good reader. So tell us some of your favorite books that you would recommend. Well, you know, one, one thing I, I've, I've revisited, and I think it's important to revisit books that you've read in the past. Because the fact is that we read a book, we put it down, we put it on a shelf, and we never look at it again. Well, I've picked up again Rich Dad, Poor Dad. And I've started reading that again and seeing things that resonate with me that didn't resonate before. And, you know, sometimes we need to hear things 30 or 40 times before they actually click with us. So this is the second time I'm reading the book. I guess I got another 30 times to read it <laughs> before it hits. But it's important that people do that. That's saying, yes. Reread, reread, reread. Repeat, repeat, repeat. I'm stuck. Is this the camera? Is this the, is this the mic? So, oh, Lewis, Lewis, Lewis. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, where are we going with now? We're going with... Do I look confused? Yes. No, this is a deliberate intention to try and close it down. Lewis, phone number. One more time. People, how will they reach you? Reach you, reach you. <laughs> uh, 404-375-7461. That's right. how they can reach me. Right. Thank you so oh. much. Peter, Peter Gibson and I would like to say thank you so much for joining us on It's a it's great, 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 great for Business Atlanta. Atlanta.